YouTube viewers, and welcome back to another episode of Scale Model Car Chief. I'm Steven. In this episode, I'm gonna be, uh, well, this will be build update number two, and then uh, update number one and my unboxing video, I came up with the idea and the plan I had in my mind on where, or the direction I wanted to go with this build. And as I look at the color choice that I picked, which was a pale yellow, um, Bright Idea was the name of the color. The more I look at it, it, it's just not sitting right with me in my vision for this build. So um, I think I'm gonna change it up a little bit. You know, I usually have a pretty set path when I build something, how I wanna move forward. But this one is just not sitting right with me. And if it's not what I want, yeah, I may as well change it up while I'm building. So I think I'm gonna go with a dark blue, you know, very similar to in build update number one video for the, uh, this Camaro. At the very end, I took a uh, factory stock photo of a young lady. She was leaning on the side of the Camaro and her uh, mod 1968 attire, and it was a dark blue car, and that really, in my mind, hit where I wanted to be with this build. So, I'll be off to the workbench, you know, to go ahead and start making the changes, and then uh, I'll show you all how it turns out. So, again, I always thank everybody for watching and tuning into my builds. Yeah, we'll see you shortly at the workbench. Okay, welcome back to the workbench. Here's that pale yellow that just wasn't working and the blue that I chose. But what always worries me on any model build is crinkling and cracking of paint. That's a lot of times why I use floor wax. So here we are, I put a coat of paint on and lo and behold, everything has to be stripped. So I lean towards a mean green it, time for the model to take a bath. Overall, the total time for uh, this stripping process uh, took about 24 hours. I just check it every couple hours and give it a little rub with a toothbrush and lo and behold, everything started coming off fairly decent. It's just a, a slow process, but when everything's said and done, the model's left in great original shape. Here we got a look as I'm getting back towards the white styrene. Another dip in the tub. The hood's now complete and the body's complete. Just a little bit more in the engine bay area. Another dip should take care of that. Come on, mean green. Back to the original starting point. Now the Camaro is ready for another coat of color. This time, hopefully I won't have any crinkling or adverse effects. So here's the blue that I envisioned. I'm sure this is gonna work out much better <laughs> than the pale yellow. But hey, that's the joy of model building. You get to change up as you go. Have a safe and blessed day. And look for the final reveal later during the week. This is Steven, the Scale Model Car Chief. Thanks for watching. 